So good afternoon, everybody. We have a call for Cranford, number seven, Forest Avenue. A referral from a family attorney. We're gonna do a little video and uh, walk everybody through the house. They had uh, two estate sales here and they sold for six days. However, um, they are not happy with um, the leftovers, so we have to do a massive clean out. Very large home. So we'll do a live video, we'll walk everybody through. I'm going to show everybody what is left. Wall art. Anybody needs a carpet? It is a monster carpet. Here's all the drapery from the windows. Very nice view. This family loved their little tchotchkes, and there is plenty of them. Nice little statue, another beautiful carpet. Of course, at an estate sale, the china cabinet never sells for some reason. Nobody wants them no more. I don't know why. Beautiful kitchen. Another country piece that never sells at an estate sale. I guess nobody wants to carry furniture. I don't know why. Back TV room. Nobody wants that chair. Old fashioned TV. Some little bit of furniture. A little bit of furniture, a little antique jug there. I think we're gonna head downstairs now because there is no upstairs. It's only a few bedrooms here. A little bit of stuff in the bedrooms. Old fashioned TV, another paperweight. Here's the beds. Another bedroom. Another useless desk that nobody wants. Old-fashioned chair nobody wants. File cabinets nobody wants. A lot of clothing in this house. Wait till you guys see the basement. Wow. Another little bedroom. It's kind of empty, but a ton of clothing left. Closets are pretty full. Now we're going to go to the fun part, to the basement. Wait till you guys see this. Two tubs filled with clothing, a lot of winter stuff. Chairs. Look at the racks. Commercial racks. Always oh, packed. Look at this pile. All socks. All hats, a lot of vintage hats. Here's a pool table. Not sure if that's going or staying. Here is a bar. Very nice home. I believe they're asking like $1.4 million. And check out the Christmas stuff. Boy, did they have plenty. This woman loved her Christmas stuff. Everything is brand new and still in the boxes. Whoever had the estate sale, they didn't sell a lot of stuff because there's a ton of stuff left over. Very pretty bows, Santa Claus, Mrs. Claus. They're all here. Do we have enough of Santa? Never enough of Santa Claus. Whole box full. There's the angels from Silent Night, Old Nick, hard side stuff, great for eBayer and resellers this house. 
I don't know where they were for the estate sale because they sure didn't come out and buy. Here's another table packed with Christmas stuff. More Christmas stuff. There has to be dozens of boxes of Christmas stuff. Some new and some vintage. A lot of wreath. Look at this table, full of clothing. Look at that closet, packed with clothing. Another thing I hate in the house clean out, exercise equipment that nobody ever uses. They buy it, but they never use it. Why? I don't know. Gonna walk our way through a maze of racks. More Christmas, more shoes. A lot of empty boxes though. So we can't sell that. We can't say that they didn't sell, but they didn't sell enough. Look at this closet. Packed with women's clothing and in very nice condition. Look at this closet, completely packed. Nice Christmas tree. More boxes marked Christmas. And this is a beautiful basement. Beautiful basement. For parties, anybody that wants to entertain. Let's go this way, because these closets must have been built into the house. Because they are packed. Look at this closet. Let's walk back out. We're going to head upstairs. And we are going to go to, to a carriage house and two outbuildings. Like kind of a, uh, a barn type. Look at those canes. Want to see the garage? Look at the garage. Everything's got to go in this house. Very little stuff is being uh, kept for the family. We're going to go upstairs and now we'll head to the yard. Where do you see this spectacular yard? Amazing. How's this for a rear yard in Cranford, New Jersey? Basement door. Look at these beautiful trees. Loaded with squirrels, they're all over the place. We're walking up to the rear of the property. You got the main house and you have a carriage house in the back with two attached sheds. Look at this gazebo, how beautiful. Swing set, beautiful trees, beautiful shrubbery. Look at the carriage house. How cool is that with two floors? Sheds are packed. 
How's the windmill? Anybody that likes metal, it's here. Tons of metal. Let's go into the shed. Where do you see this mess? Now all the shelves are full. Cabinet after cabinet filled with nuts and bolts, washers. Anybody need baskets for ShopRite? Here they are. This shed is locked, so we're not going to bother with that one. We're going to open up this shed. And we're going to take a peek in here because this one is full. Never enough garden hoses. Need more. Snow blower. More Christmas stuff, more cement, more shovels, more rakes. We never have enough. Always got to have the extra ladder. Christmas stuff, antique stuff, vintage stuff. Boy, this guy liked his tchotchkes. Going to close this shed up. We're going to carriage house and that's it. Take a quick peek. Two floors. Probably a whole another building just for another family to live. Now we're gonna go into carriage house. Desk, nobody bought at the estate sale. More buckets of Christmas stuff. More towels. More tables. Chairs nobody wants no more, I guess. Another room packed with stuff. Vintage. A lot of suitcases. I think all this stuff stays. More junk here. Some stuff is marked not for sale. And let's go upstairs. Look at the second floor of this carriage house. You would never see this in Cranford, New Jersey. Maybe Warren Township or Wachung. It's beautiful. Hardwood floors. Here's an extra bathroom. Walk-in shower. Here's a whole living area. I would say for the maids. Here's a bed. Little kitchenette set up. Little college refrigerator. Some junk on the shelves. That's it. That's what you get for 1.4 million Cranford, New Jersey on Forest Drive. Another clean out for us. A lot of stuff left over. Look at that fan, how nice. We're going to lock up and head out. And look at this driveway as we walk out. Imagine if you had a party. All the cars and the families that you could fit up here. Look at this driveway, how long it is. How about in the winter, you want to shovel that, use your snowblower on that? Well, he had three snowblowers, so I think that was plenty. And at the end of the driveway, there's a captain sitting there, very nautical looking style. I don't know if that's going. I don't know if that's staying. But we're going to lock up the house. We're going to show you a quick shot of the captain sitting there. And that's it. But they said at the sale, a lot of tchotchkes, outside stuff, did sell. I'm surprised that nobody bought this guy. He's really cool. 
Look at him, all by himself. All right, guys, we're going to sign off and have another video for you maybe tomorrow. Thank you for watching.